What is Google Customer Match? How will it help your YouTube advertising campaigns and how do you become eligible for it? So Google Customer Match basically allows you, allows you to upload your email list, your uh, customer list onto Google and then target those people on YouTube, Google Display Network, as well as Google Search. Also, Google creates similar audiences from that list. So you're basically able to target people who are similar to your customer list. A very key point of differentiation is that customer match just refers to uploaded lists, while there are other retargeting lists you can also use, such as website visitors based on your Google remarketing tag or your Google analytics tag, uh, YouTube viewers, YouTube engagers, YouTube commenters, etc. So this is a very useful feature. However, you need to be eligible for it. So to be eligible for it, there are a few rules. Number one, you must have $50,000 of spend in your Google Ads account. Number two, you must have a good history of policy compliance. If you've been getting suspended a bunch of times, if you have a lot of policy compliance issues, then you may not be eligible. Number three is you need to have a good payment history, right? Like if, if you're having a lot of declined transactions in your Google Ads account and your ad account is getting paused because payments aren't going through, that could jeopardize it as well. And the last requirement is you need at least 90 days of history with Google Ads. Now, once you do become eligible, how do you use this? So I'm gonna just show you where you go inside Google Ads to upload this list, starting here. Hey, so I'm going to show you how to get the upload your customer list and your customer match data into Google Ads. So what you do is you click on Tools and Settings you go to Shared Library, Audience Manager, and then if you're eligible, you will go here, click Customer List, and you will get a message. To, um, basically, if you're not eligible, you'll get this message, and if you're eligible, then you would be able to upload your email list into here, um, usually in an Excel or CSV format. Okay, I hope that was useful. So now we've discussed it. How do you use Customer Match? How, is it, how can it help your business? How can it help you just uh, really get better results? So number one is retargeting customer, uh, customer match audiences. So your email list, for example, you can retarget them with a special offer just for your email list. Now, this could be something like uh, you know, a special holiday promotion or a special list only offer. The key thing is that you're basically reaching out to a warm audience, giving them a special deal and making them feel special by saying something like, hey, I know you are, you're on our list, we just wanted to create this awesome offer for our family, et cetera. Or it could be even your buyers list and you could reach out to them by uh, you know, having a message that's similar to, hey, you're a loyal buyer, we want to reward you, here's 30% uh, off uh, with this discount code, et cetera. So that's one way to use your email list slash customer list data with customer match. Now, another interesting way to use this data is to exclude your buyers list. Now, you can already do that by excluding uh, people who end up on a certain URL but that really only has a certain time period, right? Uh, what you really want to do is upload your email list of buyers and do this every 15 to you know, 20 days or even more frequently if you have a lot of buyers because you know, you'll have people who bought five, six years ago and you don't want those people to be hit by the ad for the same product. Uh, so that's another way to use customer match audiences. The final way is similar audiences. So similar audiences are basically, you know, audiences that are created from the existing audiences in your Google Ads account. So Google will automatically take the email lists or the customer list that you uploaded and create similar audiences out of them. Now the similar audiences are basically people who Google thinks are similar to, your, uh, to the people that you uploaded. Uh, I don't think similar audiences in Google are as good as Facebook ad lookalike audiences, but they are pretty good. You can get some great results. We've seen some pretty promising results, so I would definitely recommend testing them. Uh, I will say they're not the holy grail like on Facebook because on Facebook they're just incredibly uh, powerful while on Google they're like good but not amazing. Like a lot of times we have our custom intent or custom uh, you know basically affinity audiences or keyword campaigns perform better than similar audience uh, basic audiences. So it's, it's a mixed bag. All right, that's, that's it for this video. I hope that was useful. If you like this video, drop a comment, subscribe, ask me any questions you have so I can keep uploading videos like this. Cheers. Talk with our feet on the ground and we will talk with our head in the clouds and we will walk